Hello, welcome back to American Truck Simulator. Fuck my face in the national back on the road, who would have thought? Let's get into it and then we'll have a little chat about what's going on, shall we? Let's go. So today you join us in Ida Bell, uh, Oklahoma. And um, we're here at Merigas. Just picked it up. Uh, there's about 30,000 pounds of uh, anhydrous ammonia. And we're going to be taking this into Little Rock, Arkansas. This will be my first trip into Arkansas. I was a bit late getting to it. Um, so I've, I think I've missed out on all the uh, all the challenge stuff and, and earning anything off it. I want to say a massive thank you to Redneck Gamer who actually gifted me this when it first came out. I just have not been on ATS in a long time. We've not done any sort of ATS or ETS on the channel for a while. Months. Months, I believe. I was going to jump on uh, Euro Truck and try and pick up on the uh, Conquer and Britain series. Try, try and get some bits done on that for today. But I noticed my Pro Mods is out of date. And um, I think Pro Mods 2.73 is still being worked on. Which I'm assuming is the one we're going to need to run with the latest version of ETS so rather than trying to roll back my ETS I figured let's jump on ATS let's have a, an American truck video let's do a delivery let's get into Arkansas and, and and see what's new there so that's what we're going to try for now this is also I will keep looking to my right this is also a bit of a test video because I have been having a lot of issues a lot of issues with uh, OBS lately and it keeps crashing on me. So hopefully, hopefully we can get through this without it crashing. I've changed some settings, I've tried to do some stuff with it. See if that'll work out for the best, we'll see. Hopefully, hopefully it will. Because I don't want to have to, uh, I, don't, I don't know what I do. If I if I go to slobs, I can't do this thing with the camera that I like to try and do sometimes. So we, we lose, we lose an editable me. We can have me in there because I stream with it. It would be the same stream settings, but when I record, I have it set up differently so I can edit this and drop me in and out whenever I want and and what have you. So I'd, I'd rather record on OBS with my OBS settings than in slobs and have to keep changing everything over. So we'll keep coming through here. Now, way back when, we did a lot of Oklahoma stuff. We did that when it was new. That was a while ago. That was a long time ago. Oklahoma. Yeah, Arkansas just didn't, just did not get to it, unfortunately. I think, you know, with everything that happened with the channel and everything that happened personally for us, a lot of stuff didn't happen. A lot of stuff has fallen behind. Um, I'm still a bit dubious on putting out new content. I really, what I really, really want to do as some of you already know, is start a Microsoft Flight Simulator 24 career. But while I don't know what's going on with my channel, I just, I'm just dubious about putting out new content. So putting out a random ATS might be all right, and we can fit it in where it, where it goes. We've already got a playlist for this, so random ATS uh, videos. Fuck while Freight's International and all that. So it's not like it's completely out there. Are you going to come up on my inside, sir? Of course you are. See if I can go now. You guys let me... and then you can come up on my inside, and then we're all good. Much better. Much more sensible. Although, I now want to switch lanes again. <laughs> oh, dear. I don't know where I'm going, do I? All good. All good. Keeping it safe, keeping it breezy. Yeah, to say that the uh, the SD logistics work has uh, fallen off um, is to be an understatement. I had a quick look in the in the company logs, and I think there's only Lone Wolf and Storm that are actually clocking up some miles for us. So this is me trying to do my part. I don't think Little Rock is a massive trip, but you never know. We, we might do a couple of these today, just so there's uh, a little bit of trucking on the schedule. We've still got our Snow Runner running. 
that's still going. I've got that queued up till about mid-December already, so we're all right with that. Had a few uh, FS25 streams. FS25 is in a bad way. Um, mainly on PlayStation, but there are issues with it on PC, optimization and and just general parts of the gameplay that are broke, which is a shame. It sort of puts me off putting out content. You know, I don't like to try and push something that I'm not happy with, especially when there's a link down in, in it to buy. You know, I'm not about that. I'm not taking it out, because I'm hoping that Giants will eventually get around to fixing it and making it a, a worthy game. I really am. And then when people watch them back, if they if they do watch them back, then the link is there, isn't it? And if people want to support the channel and, and purchase through the link, they can. If you don't, that's uh, not a problem. It's completely understand. You coming out, buddy? You certainly are. But yeah, FS25. I'm not, I'm I'm not overwhelmed with it. To say the least, not overwhelmed with it. Perhaps once we get a more realistic map, or maybe a funner map, um, it'll hook me a bit. But yeah, very very limited on tractors. You know, maps are El Generico for sure. As I said there's a lot of a lot of bugs, a lot of glitches with it. Oh, there's stutter in there. That's probably my OBS dying. <laughs> but I have been uh, quite surprised with how much fun I've had with the flight sim lately. Been doing a lot of free flights, and that's why I'd like to do the career. The career looks really interesting. Oh, I look like I could have stayed in that middle lane. I wasn't quite sure on how this how this junction was working, so I've come right over, but we should be alright. We'll just have to filter our way back across when we can. It's the trouble not knowing these roads. Yeah, even even like even Flight Simulator came out and it was in a bad way. But within like 48 hours, you know, it was Microsoft, um, they released a big patch, they fixed a lot of things that were uh, broken within Korea and within other things. And some optimization problems, and it's fine. It runs fine now. Obviously, there's a few little things that need tweaking, some AI planes and stuff like that. But the game's not as broke as it was. And another game that I've been enjoying on and off uh, since launch is uh, Stalker 2, which again, another broken game on launch. This is this is the way of gaming, and people keep saying that you have to accept it. You don't have to accept it. You re you refund or you complain. I complain. I want Stalker 2 to do well. Uh, those guys built that game while getting blown up in bomb shelters and in hospital bunkers in Ukraine. I'm allowing them to have a few issues. <laughs> I'm not quite sure what Microsoft and Giants' uh, excuse is. Other than lack of competition. That is, for me, that is, that is the biggest problem with Giants and the biggest problem with Farm Sim at the minute. There is no competition to keep them on their toes, there's no reason for them to push boundaries and really, you know, make the game great, there's no reason for them to release a game that's fully working, because you're not going to jump on any other game r r other than their old game, so if you're not playing FS25, you're probably playing FS22, it's all giants, they don't care it's just I mean, there needs to be a good competitor that does I wish I knew about gaming. I knew, wish I knew about gaming. I wish I knew about uh, game development, programming, that sort of stuff. I'd love to have a crack at doing stuff like that. I, I, I don't know where to start. That's not what I do. That's not my skill set. My skill set is being a moany, <laughs> grumpy middle aged man. But I know that when I spend money on something, I expect to get what I paid for and, and not something else. I'm fed up with buying games and games being a promise down the line. If I buy a game, I want it to be there when I pay for it. I don't want it to maybe maybe turn up six months later. I'm fed up with seeing people defend this practice of half-baked games. But, oh, it's the way it is now. You have to accept it. You don't have to accept it. You don't. Our man Rusty, he, he refunds everything. 
Why? Because he does not accept the broken games. He doesn't accept s s even small minor issues or even major issues. I like that he refunds a game if it doesn't allow him to set up a left hand optimization. I love that. Why aren't why aren't people thinking about lefties? What why is that not a basic thing, especially on like he says on PC? You should be able to set up for left hand straight out of the box. You should be able to pick which keys you're using. That should be a thing. That should never be an issue. If it's a keyboard and mouse game, there's nothing to say it has to be WASD. Why can't it be, you know, UHJK? Why can't that be? Or why can't I just use the arrow keys? I would have want the arrow keys. Because there's nothing else around them. But there's no reason why you can't be using IJKL to get about with uh, P and U instead of Q and E. It's just, it's all there. If you're not allowing that, then it's just nuts. Just checking out recording. So back to our delivery for a little bit. Should we have a little look what we got? So, like I say, we're coming out of what did I say it was? Edonia something? I forget what it's called here in Oklahoma. Uh, I, I, I wish we were starting somewhere else because I never know how to pronounce that place. Uh, we are running to uh, Little Rock, Arkansas, to Union Pacific, and uh, and Arjos Ammonia. Like I say, about thirty thousand uh, pounds. We're going to get eleven grand for this one. It's about a seven-hour trip, so this shouldn't take us too long. Expected to arrive between sort of four fifteen and eleven o'clock. So uh, an evening delivery, hopefully. Probably need to slow down. I think, oh, that's, that's, it's been a while since we've driven. There we go. If I put my uh, speedo like that, I can see that better. Now, I think, if I edge forward, I think this is a right on red state. So, providing it's safe, we can just go. I like change for us anyway. You must remember to uh, to stop. I want to try and come over here as well. Get behind the UPS truck. Be a good boy. But anyway, I hope you're all well. Um, I hope you enjoy a surprise uh, ATS trip. It's been a long time. Feels naughty to have not been here. Just even like casually for myself, I haven't been here in ages on ATS. That I mean, ETS obviously I do a lot more frequent than ATS. I have not been here in a long time, but I have been putting the work in. Um, we have, although I think financially we don't look good. Twelve grand. We've got twelve grand because oh, forgotten where my buttons are. Look. Um, yeah, I've been growing the company in the background since the last. Um, company convoy that I was part of which was a long time ago we haven't seen the company convoy in a long while um, I uh, I've been trying to build up the my my own company on here my own <laughs> uh, there, fuck our freights and uh, it's getting there we now own I think five or six small to medium garages we have I think 12 drivers on board as well now so we've had growth we're doing well the money will start coming in so yeah I have I have been putting the hours in before we stopped putting the hours in if that makes sense I I was having a good go I was doing some long trips I was doing you know Texas to Colorado and I was, I was going all the way up into Washington State and then coming back down to Texas and I like Washington State. We're never over there when I record or, or stream or anything like that because we always tend to be doing stuff in the new states, uh, you know, as you do, like to see something new. But I, I love getting up there in, in Washington State. I just think it's such a cool area of the country. I like the windy roads, the hills, the mountains, all the woodland. I don't even think we are yet into the new state are we are we now in oh we are we are in we are 
in um oh, i forgot where we were now where are we going <laughs> my brain no it's left get on people what's holding us up just lights Come on, Broski. Let's get going. Mr. Meso Gym. Let's go to the gym. GameStop. I do like having a look. Oh, there's uh, no real texture on that one. That's a shame. Rest of looks pretty cool, though. We'll stop off, get gas and KFC. There we go. That light felt like that was forever. Arkansas. There you go. It's a Little Rock, Arkansas. It came to me. Probably saw my lips doing the old workings out. <laughs> Dirt in your head. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's Little Rock, Arkansas, isn't it? So I'm guessing I want to slow down and let you get past so that I can pull over into your lane, sir. Get over before that next truck comes along. I've got a left turn coming up. We don't have no uh, navigation voice on our ATS, so actually have to pay attention ourselves. Smooth. It feels alien, honestly. The trucking feels alien. More alien than flying the plane, and I've been doing the trucking stuff for years. The plane stuff I've been doing for about two weeks. Looks nice here. Is that a ranch up there? That looks cool. Can't really see it while driving, unfortunately. So, yeah, while I'm waiting for. Uh, for. Uh, oh, that's my slow thought speech. While we're waiting for. 2.73, I'm sure that's what it is, 2.73, for European Pro Mods. We might get one or two uh, ATS videos out, we'll see. We will see, just because I like to, I like chilling with it. And I don't feel like I'm trying to introduce something new. I'm, I'm, I'm really hopeful, I, I, I'm trying to be positive, I don't think I'm going to have to start again. I don't think, oh, also, uh, we just surpassed this morning, the morning of me recording this anyway. Surpassed uh, 40,000. 40? That'd be a dream, wouldn't it? 4,000 subscribers. Which is awesome. So thank you very much. Uh, yeah, so hopefully we don't have to start over again from zero. That would be extremely upsetting. Plus, there's not 40,000 people that are actively watching this channel. So it's not like they're all going to come over. We'd be lucky if we got 100 in the first week. So, yeah, we don't want to start over. We want to get to the end of December and YouTube go alright I'm sorry we made a mistake even though you've deleted all the videos that were all yours anyway and you've lost all traction and you've lost all your finance from it we'll let you come back in there's a penny that's what we need just so I can get a little bit of spring in my step start the new year with a spring in our step we'll be like yeah we're doing this we're going to crush it 5,000 subs next year <laughs> oh dear. Not up to 5,000 subs, but 5,000 more. Let's make it 9,000 subs <laughs> next year. That'd be mental. Not going to happen, obviously. But. Slowly, slowly. You never know, I might bite the bullet and I might start the flight sim before then. So, there's um, sort of talking over a little bit with uh, Simi Dad in the Discord. Come join the Discord, guys. Link's down below. And um, 
like he was saying, why don't you just record it all and then release it when you know what's going on with your channel? And I'm, I'm cool with that. I, you know, there's some other stuff I, I've got recorded that I might put out anyway. But like for me, there's sort of two things with that. I want to obviously play it now, so there'd be quite a lot recorded, storing it somewhere. You know, eventually your PC fills up. Um, so you're having storage for it all because I can't upload it and then if they say well no this channel's not getting back in if I start a new channel I can't re-upload that content um, so again I'd have to restart start again so yeah storage on that wise is a is a thing although I, I am contemplating it but also it's sort of the everything I play apart from farms in generally is always always an old game like, there's that, oh, there's a new game in Flight Sim. I don't want to have a Flight Sim community, but there's a new game, Flight Sim. A few people in the Discord are enjoying it. I'm sure if we got a few views on it, it would reach a little bit further and more people would see it. Come January, it'll be two months old. It's no longer a new game. So that vibe of it has gone. And the same with Stalker. Like, I really wanted to do some Stalker stuff. But by the time... I know what I'm doing and, and what's going on with the channel waiting until January, February it's not new again and you don't have to play new games as as I said most of the stuff that I've played on this channel other than the farms and when they come out it's, it's never new, never new games I wanted to keep working through my back catalogue um, some of you will have noticed most of the content has disappeared from the channel um, I've deleted well over 1500 videos off the channel and I mean completely deleted them, they're not hidden, they're not set private, gone. Almost started like a new slate anyway with the channel. Less than a thousand videos on there. And I'm probably going to start doing a second Mr. Farquhar channel again for my other content. Because I tried bringing it back, it didn't really work. So that's gone. And I'll do that away. And please don't come and follow it. Don't subscribe to it if you're not interested in watching me play other games. I don't want pity subs. I don't want oh, I'll give you the support. I don't want that. I want I want viewers. <laughs> I'm not interested in pity subs. I'm not interested in people dropping a sub to support because it doesn't support. It hinders the channel. Inactive subscribers kill a channel. Last time I did it. You know, I had like 150 people come over and sub up within a week and no one watched a single video. Like, what was the point in doing that? All you did was help my channel. So we've done one that. If you're not interested in variety games, shooters, action adventures and all that sort of stuff, don't bother. I like um, walking simulators and, and stuff like that. So if that's not your thing, don't bother. I, I'm not offended if you do not want to support a second channel by me. That doesn't matter. It will find its own. I mean, that's why the content isn't here. Because people didn't watch it. Those that are here don't watch it. I do already have another channel that I I was putting shorts out on. But that, that sort of fell behind. But I'm going to keep doing that. Again, just for something different. It's, it's all... It's like practice and learning for new things. It's new, learning new ways of editing stuff, learning new ways of presenting stuff, putting it across. Because then, with the shorts, like my TikTok account doesn't care whether my whether my TikToks go up with Mr. Farquhar as the name, or with just games as the name, or with anything else as the name. TikTok don't give a crap, so I can put them all on one account. Shorts galore's over there. Like I was, I did say I was gonna jump on uh, Twitch and do some streaming over there while we were sorting out with the, the YouTube thing. But I mean, I would like to go back and do some more Twitch streaming. But I didn't want it to feel like, oh, we're, we're moving away from YouTube and we go to Twitch just so I can earn twenty p. 
You know, that that would feel a little bit. As much as I want to go back over there, I did want it to feel like, oh, come and watch me over there, because there you'd have to watch the ads and pay to watch and, and do all that. So I didn't do it. I'm not that desperate for the money in that sense. I'd just like YouTube to pay me for, for what I do here. <laughs> I'd like my stack pennies back, please. Plus, both me and my daughter need new controllers. So we <laughs> I need that. I need money for two new controllers. Nice ones as well, not, not cheap ones. I mean, she's a big girl and she should be able to buy her own controller. But I've always, I've always sorted her Xbox out for her. weird that OBS has um, held up for this. I mean, I'm not going to complain that OBS hasn't crashed yet. But I bet as soon as I try and record something else. Try and record what I tried to record the other day. I, I was... You probably have seen a few of them by now. Um, spent a whole day just recording um, my first looks at some of the placeables that have come to FS25. Because the modders are going to be was clearly going to fix that game and make that game and like, like they do anyway but I think MS25 is going to rely heavily on the, the modern community so I thought I'd go have a look at some of them sheds and show some light on them with my little community and, and do that one of those videos OBS crashed on me oh you absolute swine OBS crashed on me seven times seven times it's madness. We're going to have to take a long detour on this one. So yeah, so then I, I switched over and I I just quickly jumped on to uh, Slob Streamlabs OBS, which is just set up for streaming. It's not set up for my recording. So I think the first video was maybe a little bit janky. I think maybe the um, frame rate was off in the recording. So I think the video looked like the game was giving off a really bad frame rate. Which the game often does give off a really bad frame rate. But in that instant, um, a lot of that was because I wasn't recording at full frame rate. Like, we're getting a weird frame rate here. We're getting a lot of stuttering. I'm not sure if this is just because we're loading in, because we're in somewhere new. That might be. I don't know. But we've never been here, so I'll, I'll let it off. Um, so yeah, because I'd only ever set slobs up for streaming... The recording settings weren't there and I'd, I'd forgotten about it so I'd just gone in everything was sort of on default I think I think it went all right afterwards I, I changed the settings and I got away for the next video so they should should be a little bit better after that but yeah it was good it was nice to have a look at them some, some of them are really really nice I was just you know fortunate that uh, Lancey boy was still kind enough to send me his uh, his new sheds early, so I'd have a little look at them and put them out there. And obviously, uh, for a little while, keep keep an eye out for the name um, American Modern Inc. American Modding Inc. That's who you want to be looking out for. Um, he's modern under that name for reasons. Reasons are for him to tell, not me. Uh, so, yeah, if you want to support him, download their mods. I don't. Um, I guess the Lancy Boy mods will come back later. Because I can't imagine the uh, the European stuff and the British stuff is going to come under American Modding Inc. Give me room, mate. I see you there. Oh, I did see you there, though. You look well close. Slow down, brother. 
But yeah, some of the other sheds that I looked to look at. There's the the old red shed pack, the old shed pack. That's really nice. I like that. I like to add the, uh, the customizable stuff as well, so you can put the extension on it and really design a, a fully custom farm with that. Nice touch. I take it this isn't a right on I'll just grab a little sip of coffee, because, you know, it's morning. Oh, Mr. Black Sedan. What's that? What do I get? What do you get done for there? I suppose it's too late now. Don't know what that was about. Maybe there was someone on my inside I didn't say? I don't know. back on my log when it comes up. Oh, it's come up on the um, trucks book already as an active one. I didn't think it normally popped up on trucks book until after you'd finished. A bit wide on that, but I've got a, got a fair old tank on the back. Shimmy our rarest of behinds over so it's time 8 30 so we're sort of banging in the middle of uh, expected delivery time i think another what two and a half hours to do this delivery and that was with a little detour as well uh, parking will be quite some point we haven't <laughs> haven't reversed in a while Give us the easy one. We're on automatic, so give us an easy one. Or on random, as it is, isn't it? Yeah, we're on. It's been that long. I don't think I've driven ATS with me glasses. So that might explain why it was a somewhat smoother journey than usual. Apart from whatever that was that caused us a financial outtake. I feel like the lights aren't very bright though. I always feel like the lights aren't very bright. Now, are we going across the crossing? We are. Is this a railway terminal here in Little Rock? No, we have an, uh, a much smaller... Oh, that looks fun. <laughs> ah, there. That looks like an amazing, an amazing parking spot. Thank you very much. What the freaky deek. Oh, dude, come on. My first one in since forever. I think we'll do this out of cab. Although maybe not always easier out of cab. I didn't get that right to start with, right you. Know. Let's try it again. I consider this quite mean.
Right. Trying to watch the tail out of the nose at the same time. concentration I think we're in I'll take that I will take that as a win we'll get rid of the beat and break on Actually, I think we can probably go back a little bit further by the looks of it let's see if we can get in there a bit more because I do still have to get out of here as well oh too much now spoiled it there we go that'll do that'll do for us right Detach. So that was 232 miles, seven hours. Nearly level 30 on this profile. And I haven't been going very long at all. Well, I have, but not, not like hours wise. So we're, we're doing all right. We're doing all right. That's fine. And the rest of the crew have been working well because we're up to 55 grand now. We started on 12, I earned 11, so that's good. But that is it for this trip. A little bit of a one-off. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. It's just me having a little bit of a chat, having a bit of a rant as I do while I truck. Um, I'll try and get the Euro truck up and running as soon as uh, 2.73 is ready with Pro Mods, and we'll get that up and running. I might do a couple more of these ATS trips in between. But like I say, hopefully you've enjoyed it. If you have, give it a big fat thumbs up down below. If you are new to the channel, hit the subscribe button, turn the bell notification on, find out when new videos are going live. That's always comments and feedback down there. You guys have a wonderful day, and hopefully I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.